Uh, everyone out there has bad password hygiene. Everyone who's watching this, um, I don't know how many of you are watching this, but I know you all have bad passwords. And everyone thinks they're being smart because they have a system, whether it's like the one secure password for their bank and their email, and then the not so good password for every other website they visit. You know, you have to acknowledge that the human brain cannot remember long, unique passwords for every web website you visit. And so we all cut corners. And the problem with that system is if you reuse the same password across multiple sites, when one of those sites gets hacked, then someone can use that password that has been hacked to log into all the other sites where you're using that. You need to move to a model where you have a unique password for every website. Okay, so that means I'm gonna have to have 50 or 60 passwords. How do I do that? How? Because my brain doesn't work. It's good that you asked that then. Uh, you need to use a tool called a password manager. These are either free or cheap. And what they will do is they will generate long random passwords for each website that you visit, and then they will enter them automatically for you every time you enter that website. And then they'll synchronize them from your smartphone to your computer. So you will never be without your passwords. And then you only have to remember one password, the password for the password manager. Um, two of the most popular password managers are LastPass and 1Password, the number one and password. I don't care what kind of password manager you use, but it's time to acknowledge that your existing password system sucks uh, and that you are one hack away from data oblivion. And so um, get with the program, use a password manager, and, and believe it or not, once you embrace the password manager lifestyle, it actually saves you time.